This is the fourth and final quarterfinal match of the 2021 Chess.com Junior Speed Chess Championship. Gary does that look. Tao does that look. Tao has a very, if you know, the my, my liking game. So Tao, um, the, the look on the cover is actually Nihal's like face, that facial expression of intense. I'm looking, I, you can tell that I am zoned in. And Nihal yeah. always looks like that to d6 whenever you play e7 so there you go and that's it the first one goes to a man and you see a shrug of the eyebrows really quickly deep breath nihal same face ready to go ready to work that's what he does he comes to do this every day day in day out and you see he's in the zone exactly right out of nowhere here this really is how you show the 3100 level what whoa, 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 uh, excuse me whoa excuse me. Oh man, he not looking. We blocked with his face there, y'all. Night before. Probably, before. yeah. Probably the the tide had already turned, but so he, you know. But this is still a lot of time for him. What is his bullet rating? Thirty three hundred. Like thirty seconds is still a minute to him. So he's fine. He's not in time trouble at all. Playing a different level. He just resigned. He's like, I don't want any more of this. I just, I'm tired of this. Where Black already has the attack. I mean, you can go G five here. This is a scary setup. Somebody said all games with ninety five and ninety five plus accuracy. Jeez. Man, this you gonna do that? Oh, this is a six. Oh my goodness! <laughs> it was just waiting. Oh and Nihal, my goodness! Nihal this shuffles in his channel. chair. He was waiting for that shot. Wow! Bishop a six. Don't do that to that. Wow! I can't believe he hit him like that. Bishop a six. H five and h six should be next. He, letting him take on f four. She can take on g seven. Queen goes to b two. You pass the queen side, bring the rook over. It's already a game. Nihal got this already. I'm calling this a dub already. I do want to point out a very funny comment from Kikipedia, who said, is this PogChamps? These guys aren't that bad. Um, <laughs> <laughs> well, as much of an insult as that might be to our players here, or maybe it's a, it's a credit to Mr. Beast. No, uh, these guys are not PogChampers. These guys are some of the best in the world, and uh, their, their star is rising because you had to be... Sorry. You had to be 20 years old or, or younger to play in our tournament here. So these are some of the best chess players in the world. Grandmaster Amin Tabatabai from Iran and our returning junior speed chess champion, Nihal Sarin from India. Yes, and absolutely. In fact, these aren't Pog champs. These are champs, Pog, right. right? Because these are really, really great players, 100%. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, White is just playing down. Okay, White's sacrificing an entire rook to dispel some of the pressure. It's actually me. Bishop D8. <laughs> Bishop D8 is main next. Yeah, in fact, right. This is a great showing from Nihal here. Nihal has not lost the game. I mean, that's a statement. The guy's 2873, no slouch, right? Grandmaster from Iran here. I mean, he's no slouch and he he can't, I mean, in a way, right now he is not, Min has not beaten Nihal. Sure, he probably has before, but hey, not today. And uh, this probably is as close as right now to beating, beating, uh, <laughs> what is this piece right now? What is this piece doing? Even have knight d4. Well, he's definitely winning or pushing for more, but man, what a bishop. So there's a lot of games left, and if black could somehow win, that would be an amazing way to go into the break. Draw, reps, that's a repetition. Wow, we don't see this Draw. often. A seven to two lead for Nihal as we go into the three minute segment. Not a single loss on his scorecard. The players are trying to play another game, but guys, oh take a little break. Yeah. Have, a little, have a little snack, have a pop with them, enjoy yourself. Because <laughs> now you feel all tied up. But believe it or not, the engine says it's plus six right now. Like you up a rook and a, and a pawn. You're up a whole rook and a pawn? I mean, it doesn't yeah. feel like that, right? Chess is very hard game. Oh, he's made it. Yeah, I mean, it's oh, gotta be Oh my game. goodness. Oh, wow. I would have preferred King King C8, Knight B6 mate would have been a cool way for the game to end. <laughs> knight B6 mate, right. Wow, he's threatening F6 and the E3 pawn. What a move, right. and he's so strong. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Queen's trapped, and it, oh man, this is rough. This is rough. There's a resi resignation. And I got that piece, and it's over. Wins by timeout. And another one there. Another and one there, and then goes down again. Yeah, so uh, Nihal, it looks like he's back to 3133, by the way. Second time he's been back knocking oh, nice. on the door of his peak rating. He's within one point of his peak rating. That's it. He needs this game. I'm like, now, come on, I need this game. I get a drop into the price six points or something. Wait a second. Oh, yeah, he found the right check. Yeah, King can't <laughs> go back to G1 because of Queen C1. Okay, so another draw, but that's it. That's all Nihal's conceding. He's up 12 to 3.
He's conceded six draws, and uh, I feel bad for Amin. He could have actually had his first win, but he offered a draw when there was two seconds on his opponent's clock when Nihal disconnected. Yeah, he might be saying at this point, man, I probably should have took that disconnection win, man. Like, this is, uh, I need a, a win. I need to win. Okay, wow. we are going to see three queens for one. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, he got a win. Amin got the win, guys. All right, and congratulations. Win. Good job. I'm in Tabit Tabai. Now, we are three hours, 10 minutes into the match. Um, and I realize we've had some breaks and some computer issues, but three hours and 10 minutes to get your first win. That might be a first in Amin's career in all of the Blitz sessions he ever played on Just.com. I'm sure he's like, oh my goodness, I can breathe. <laughs> Pretty good. And White wins that one as a resi there. And uh, yeah, that's 13 4. Great stuff. Oh, he just blundered. Uh, yeah, game. he certainly did. GG, start a new game. Yeah, and he's mad at himself. Whoa. He just flicks his fingers and looks around the room. Oh, man, look at him. He just, I mean, you can just see the stress. It's just straight stress on his face right now. And it's hard to see. It really is hard to see. We go through it ourselves, right? You know, where you, we can just stop. You know, you lose three games in a row, four in a row. You know, you should stop. You should go somewhere else, probably play something else. But you mm -hmm. can tell 10, 10, 15 games in a row, right? But now in this match like this, you literally have to play every single game out. And here, it really tests your mental strength right now. And it's tough being down. 12 games, bro, 12 games. He's only won one game. That's hilarious. That's kind of how we're calling this match. I spent a minute messing around about whatever. I come back and Nihal is just winning another it's game. Winning. It's like, yeah, you know, winning. How's Nihal Thank playing? You. Nice. Great. Great. Back yeah, to nice. you, James. Back <laughs> to you in the studio, James. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Incredible. Incredible play from Nihal Saren today. Oh, wait, does he have him? Oh, he doesn't. It just feels like a man has something. Like, you give the man a break here, right? It feels like he has something. And yeah, he well, doesn't. The White Scots has passed H-Pawn, but he's been dealing with oh. way too many threats to push it, and he's been trying to find a hiding place for his king. Oh, Ooh. my goodness. Made he it. He did Jeez. not find a hiding place for the king. Get this off the screen. Man. Jeez. I don't even see a way around that. Even if he would have took the rook, I don't think he could have got back in time. But Bishop is beautifully placed. This is just getting out of hand. Yeah. This he's... is every single game he's won, I think, in the bullet. North Carolina, and I believe oh, if you get man. vaccinated in North Carolina, you get a free donut. Dang, I just got everything. Giving out free donuts. True to form, Nihal wins a meaningless final game. Well, it was probably worth about 20 bucks, which makes the final score 23 and a half to four and a half. That's not a typo or whatever the verbal version of a typo is. Mm -hmm. uh, that is the actual final score. He wins by 19 games and advances to the semifinals where he will play Hike. Matarosian. We had a chance for two Iranians to qualify for the semis. It turns out two Indians will qualify for the semis. And Iranians, fear not, Parham Magsudlu is still in this thing. He is going to play. Uh, Nihal, what makes you so good in these matches? To win six in a row is just amazing. So what do you think your biggest quality is for winning these matches? Um, okay, I just uh, I just like it a lot to play Blitz and Bullets. And in long matches, I I generally take some time to warm up and when it goes longer I usually I can adapt and play a bit better. So I guess this format suits me completely. Well you definitely showed it today.